everyone welcome back to my channel and if you're new then thanks for joining us today for this little haul video I hope you enjoy it if you do don't forget to give it a thumbs up and please if you are new then click the subscribe button and join us and we'd love to have you here don't forget to click the little bell as well to notify you every time I upload a video this is a little haul by a company that I did not know anything about it's a company called blooming jelly and they actually reached out to me a few months ago and asked if I was interested in trying their clothes they offered to send me a few pieces in return for a video and a review on on YouTube so I checked out the website they had some really really nice pieces so I thought why not why not I'll give it a shot and I'll let you guys know please note that even though these items were gifted to me um, I didn't pay for them I didn't have to pay for shipping on them or anything um, I will give you a totally honest review of the items. I'm not going to be swayed by a few freebies, even though I absolutely freaking love a freebie. Absolutely love a freebie. Um, but if they arrived and they were absolutely rubbish, believe me, I would tell you that they were rubbish. The company have also um, given me a little discount code for you guys. So if you do like any of the items that I picked or you want to go and check their website out, then I'll pop it here on the screen, the little discount code. It'll also be in the description along with links to the items that I picked. Yeah, we'll dive straight in and I'll show you what I got. So first off, the company started 2014. Um, I'd never heard of them before until they actually reached out to me. But when I checked out the website, it looked really, really nice. They packaged all of their things. They all came in these little bags, these little Ziploc bags, which I thought were really nice and you can use to store your clothes in, like your winter things to pop under the bed or in the attic or whatever. So they're quite, quite cute. They are always switching up their website. So the items change quite regularly. So there's always loads of on-trend things on there. Um, I was really, really impressed by the website. The items looked really, really nice. I picked three dresses and a top. But there were some really, really nice swimwear bits on there as well that I was quite tempted by. But I don't really need any new swimwear at the moment. So I didn't go for any swimwear. But check it out. There were some really nice swimsuits on there. What the quality is like, I couldn't tell you because obviously I didn't get one. But they were really nice. And first up, I will show you the top that I picked. So as you can already see, it's a little red top with white spots. I do like a polka dot. So this is what it looks like. I will put a picture of me trying it on. Um, it's like a little crossover top. It looks like it's got like a little tie detail there. So it looks like it's a wrap, but it doesn't actually undo into a full on wrap. It's just stitched. It's gathered at the waist. So you do have this sort of elasticated bit in the, in the middle and it's like a little peplum. And you've also got this little ruffle detail on the sleeve which is quite cute and on the top of the sleeves you've got that little I don't know what this is called you know what I mean when it just raises slightly it's quite a nice little feature I will say that they all all the items that I got the dresses and the top they feel really nice they're not overly thin I think the quality is quite good yeah I don't know what it's made out of what's this one made out of let me find the little label this is just polyester and spandex but it does feel really soft I've, I've got this thing where I really like silky feeling things and it is quite a silky feeling top but I just thought this would be really cute for work or for like an evening if I'm going for a meal or paired with some black trousers or some jeans and some little red shoes yeah I thought that would be a good one for work and I do like it it's nice it fits quite nicely I think it's quite a flattering style as well next up I've got something in one of my favourite colours, this lovely mustard yellow. You'll have to excuse the fact that everything is really, really creased. Obviously, they come in these little bags. I did open it as soon as I got them because whenever I get mail, I am too excited to wait. I have to rip into it straight away to have a look. And I did sort of fold everything back up and pop it back into the bags, but obviously it, it's got creased. That's just life, isn't it? So they are a little bit creased and they will be creased in the try-on. But yeah, I picked up this little um, mustard yellow dress again it's that same sort of crossover design which i do really like and none of these are really low either so you get that nice crossover detail without it being too revealing it's got a lovely the lovely little puckered sleeve again just a little short sleeve 
these aren't tight on the arms though which is nice it's quite loose again that same sort of feeling material really silky and soft what i liked about this one was the little waist it's actually i'm not sure if you can pick that up very well on camera but it's got like a panel in the middle so you've got a line just under the bust and then a little um, line a bit further down sort of on your just above your hips maybe so you've got like a little defining line around your waist my waist is definitely the smallest part of my body and um, so i do like to define that and at the back it's got this little elasticated section which is great so one thing i was really worried about when i ordered these items was that i ordered a medium the sizing is a small is like a six to eight and then a medium is a 10 to 12 and then a large is a 14 to 16. so I'm sort of a 10 to 12, depending on the item, depending on where it's from. Sometimes I need a 12 to 14. So I was worried that I had to order a 10 to 12 because I thought with a lot of the websites that I tried in my, what did I call that video? The bargain store haul, where I tried out a lot of the cheaper budget fashion websites, a lot of their items came up small. So I panicked when I ordered them, but I knew that if I ordered a 14 to 16, everything would just be way too big on me. So um, I was worried about the sizing and I have to say everything fits really nicely, really, really nicely. Um, yeah, this comes down into sort of like a skater style um, bottom. It's really comfortable. It feels really nice. I really like the colour. Uh, the only problem I had was this little um, crossover section at the top gate, a little tiny bit. But I think if I just put a little stitch in near the bottom, I think that'll sort that out. Just have a little invisible zip at the back just to help you put it on. But yeah, I was really happy with that and I really like it. And I think that's something that I could wear for work or that I could wear for a christening or a wedding or anything. I think it's a really, really nice little dress. Next up, I bought a holiday dress. I saw this on the website. It was the first thing that I saw that I thought, I've got to get that. Because I was looking for something really similar last year for when we went on holiday and I couldn't find one. I'd seen one on people's hauls from Primark, but I just couldn't find it in my local store and I was really gutted. And then I saw this one on the website. It looked absolutely stunning on the model. And I thought, I'm having that. Now, I didn't realise the pattern was quite so floral. I'm not sure if you can pick that up on the camera. But it is a very, I would say, quite girly little floral pattern, which isn't normally something I would go for. But it is quite cute. You've got an elasticated, like, bardo-style um, top with little tiny sleeves as well, which I did quite like. I think that will help sort of keep it down a bit more when it's just like a boob tube. I just don't find it sits very well on me. So I'm hoping that looks a bit better. It is elasticated sort of to the waist and then just flows out. It is really long at the back. I'm quite short. I'm only, I wanna, I wanna say 5'3", but I don't even think I'm quite 5'3". So I am quite short, and this comes really long on me at the back. What I really liked about it was the fact that at the front, and you'll be able to see this in the try-on, it's um, a lot shorter at the front. You can just see there that there's a little slip underneath, but it is a lot shorter at the front, and it just comes open at the front, and then longer at the back and the edge is sort of uh frilled it's really hard to show obviously a maxi dress on a camera like this and you'll get a better idea of how it fits on the try on clip but this is so comfortable it is so cool i cannot wait to take this on holiday this year and wear it i think it's going to be great for evenings on holiday just going for a meal or some drinks it's not short so i don't have to worry about like running around with the kids like i say it's got this little slip underneath so even though it is shorter at the front, you haven't got to worry if it blows open, you're still going to maintain your dignity. Um, yeah, I just really like it. It's really pretty. It's not something I would normally wear. I don't think I own anything like this in my wardrobe. And I usually steer clear of sort of midi and maxi skirts because I'm quite short and I just feel like they swamp me a little bit. But I really, really liked that. And I think because it is shorter at the front, I can get away with the length at the back really happy with that one this one feels a bit different the material let's find out if this is um made of different material if i can find a label anywhere proving difficult i can't find a label anywhere on this one to see what the material is but it feels um, more cottony than the and the dress that i've already shown you definitely feels more cottony but yeah really love that one really pleased with that one and i think oh, i just put my elbow on my desk 
does that hurt so much? And it's not a desk, it's my bedside table. Don't know why I said it was a desk. Anyway, really happy with that one. I think I'm gonna get loads of wear out of that. But I've saved my favorite for last. I saw this on the website and I didn't for one minute think that it was gonna suit me, but I just really, really liked it. And I thought, since as I'm not actually paying for it, I'll give it a try and I'll order it and if it doesn't look nice I can pass it on to a friend or I can send it to the charity shop and I haven't actually lost out because I didn't pay for it but I really really love the design and I really wanted it to look nice you'll see it in the try on but I really like it whether it suits me or not I don't know I don't care really I really like it so if everyone else thinks I look absolutely horrendous I don't care because it is really nice it is this blue and white striped little strappy dress it's got those gorgeous tortoiseshell buttons running all the way down and it is a long maxi dress. I mean, it is pretty maxi on me. If you were taller, obviously, it's going to be probably more of a midi, but I am extremely short. I really liked the blue and white stripes. As you already know, if you've watched any of my videos before, I'm obsessed with these buttons. I've got them on loads of things. Yeah, it's got, again, the little elasticated section in the back which is really helpful because the rest of the material on this one isn't very giving unlike the others and I was worried that I wasn't going to get it on. It's got a little invisible zip in the side there, can't really see but there is a little invisible zip, not a very big one but if it wasn't for that I don't think I'd have got it over my chest. Another great thing about it is it's got adjustable straps so you don't often find that with some of the cheaper more budget fashion brands but that has got adjustable straps, so it's perfect. I needed to alter mine to make it fit. But I just absolutely love it. I also love the fact that you can undo these buttons. So if you want to make more of a slit at the front, you can. If you want to cover up more and do them all up and just have a tiny slit at the bottom, you can. I just think it's really flattering. I love the fit of it. I think it's really summery. And I cannot wait for the weather to pick up so that I can get myself into this i think it's going to be perfect for summer drinks summer parties not that i'm a little social butterfly or anything but i just really love it and i think even for holiday just for days where you're just strolling about on a day out just walking around i think it's going to look really classy i really really love it i really love that one that again is more of a cotton material like i say it's not very giving that one what is this one made of 35% cotton and 65% polyester. Easily my, my favourite one out of the three, but I love all the dresses and I really like the top as well. And yeah, I'm I was really impressed. I was really worried about the items coming and being rubbish and not fitting, being too small and me not even being able to get into them, but they all fit really well. I think they're quite decent quality. I'm really, really pleased with them and I will definitely check out the website again. Like I said, the swimwear looked really, really nice. The next time I need to update my swimwear, I probably will check out their site and see if there's anything on there because there were some really nice pieces. They tend to do a big range of colours as well for items. So I know the stripy dress came in at least three colours. So you can have a scroll through if you think you like the items that I've picked, but the colour probably isn't for you, it doesn't suit your tone then have a look because there'll be other colours on there. I'm really impressed with it. And thank you, thank you so much to Blooming Jelly for reaching out and sending me those items. I'm really pleased with all of them. So if you like them or you want to check out the website, don't forget to use the code. There is a link to the website and a link to all of the items in the description bar below. So if you just click on the little arrow, the show more, it will open up the description bar and you'll be able to see and click straight through. They're not affiliate links. I, haven't, I don't earn any money or any commission from them if you use them. So it's it's up to you whether you do or not, but they're there if you want them and it doesn't bother me either way because I'm not making anything from them. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. I really enjoyed that one. I really like the clothes. I cannot wait for the weather to pick up. What has happened to the sunshine? Where has it gone? I can't wait for it to pick up so I can get some of those pieces out of my wardrobe and get them on and wear them. It's exciting. If you did like the video and you'd like to see more clothing hauls, then please give it a thumbs up. Drop me a comment below in the box. I love speaking to you guys and having a 
conversation let me know which was your favorite piece whether you think they suited me or whether you think i should try a different style always happy to interact with you guys so thanks for watching and i'll see you for another video very very soon bye guys bye.